end of my videos will show you all the information you need to give to PayPal or where to deliver to my house. Okay, we'll try to show you the, how to put on, I don't know what they called, but it's using thread for a buttonhole. See how that right there goes on there? So now let me find what I did with my, th <laughs> with my needle. <laughs> so I'm, I'm like, I don't want to put another pin on there. Now I have thick thread. It's a real thick thread. Okay. So now after you sew your button on, you want to take and put it in a start sewing it. You want to put it like that right there so you tie it down. Okay. Now you want to take your thread here. You want to make sure you have enough room to go around it. And let's get rid of that thread that's sticking up there. So that looks good to me. So I'm going to take and put me a stitch right here in there. Okay. And I'm going to put me another stitch to hold it down to where I want it at. Okay, so it kind of like holds it in there. Now I'm going to take my button out. So now all I'm going to do is I'm going to start sewing in my hole here. And you want to put your thread on the other side like that and keep on going around with it <clears throat> all right thought I got it but I guess I didn't there we go Hear my wind chimes out there. See, it'll go all the way around till you get all the way to the bottom. All right, I think that's cool enough. So now we're going to go back into it. And then we're going to tie off. And that should be good enough for Miss Emmy. Do it about three times. There we go. Now all we have to do is just cut our thread. Tie it because the needle will come off of this thread easy. There we go. So, now then, try it out. See there. All right. Now we can put this back on the doll. <laughs> Button it down. Her little hands would probably be a whole lot better. <laughs> But my kind of don't want to work the way I want them to. Okay, there goes one. And there's two. So now she has buttons on her dress. I think this is really pretty. All right, now we want to make a jacket for her. Okay. So, as you can tell... I have it ready to cut out. Now, it does not come with this piece. 
but I'm going to use this piece again because hey it worked really well the first time so I don't see why it won't work well the second time okay there's our first piece I don't need all this so we'll get rid of that cut that in half and make it easier <laughs> All right. Now then. We have, are going to have darts right in here. So let me show you what I did with the darts. See, I have my darts already there. So I'm going to turn this one over. I'm going to turn this one over. And I'm going to take me... This right here is a dry eraser marker. And I'm just going to mash it right on my dots. Okay? Now, if you can see... That they have showed up there. All you got to do is just make it a little bit darker. So that took care of those. We have that. Now we have the back one we need to cut out. And it is a cut on fold. So we have that. This one right here should not be that hard to do. Next thing I want to do is make her a case to uh, put these Barbie doll, put her Barbie doll in. She only has one. This is Emmy's Barbie doll. I don't know if I showed it to you or not, but I want Emmy to keep up with her Barbie dolls. Say, all right. Grab that back. Put that back down there. Alrighty, now then. First thing we want to do is we want to fold this down. Oh, excuse me. And sew it down our line right here. And in this one, I had pizza and I don't like pizza. All right, we're going to sew these two down, and I got to put my red thread back in there. All righty, we have those done. Now, this right here shouldn't take, hopefully, not long at all, because I don't want it to. I want to make that pouch. I want to get busy on a quilt now. I think I've done have my fun with this one. So there is that. Now how come is both of them the same? Oh no. There we go. That's better. Alrighty. So now what we want to do is we want to sew this down and this down. So we'll be back. Alrighty. Get rid of all these strings that we have. Now then, we want to 
sew this on. Dude. I will pin it down. Can. Bend it, straighten it, however you got to do it. Make her work. <laughs> there we go. That one's hitting me right up again. Yes! Man, that right there, I like that thing. Because <laughs> it does make it work a whole lot quicker to have something like that. Take, fold this right here down. Now we want to iron, uh, iron it down and then go sew that down. Alrighty. Alright, get it here. You don't need it no more. You're done with it. Alright, now we got that done. Okay. Now then, what we want to do next is we want to hem our sleeves. So this is one of the sleeves. Okay, come over here to the other sleeve. All right, we're going to go uh, sew them down. All righty, now we have the sleeve. See how quick this is going? I knew it was going to go so quick. Yes. All right, now then, what we want to do from here is we want to take and sew the arms down right here, all the way down on both sides here. All righty. See how quick this is going really, really quick. I figured it would. So, now we got down to here. Now we need to put a hem on it. So, my hem that I want to do is going to be this right here, black. So, I want to take Oh, let's go with a two and a half. Two and a half. Now I don't want to get rid of this. I'm going to use this right here too. About two and a half. There we go. Now, I want to sew it all the way down and around. Now then, we got that one. Now I want to take iron it there we go and now cut this part off even with it you see now then we got some little black on the bottom now I want to take and hem this Alright, let's hem that. Yeah, I'm going to use red. I think red gives it a good look right down there. I know there's two strings. Where's the other one? 
All right. Now we have the um, sides here that we got to put something on. So let me see. Which way do I want to go with it? How do I want to do that? It's turning out pretty. There we go. So far, so good. All right. Now, I think, yeah, let's see if we got enough to do. Two. Come on. Don't need all this junky. Ah. Make sure that goes away from me. <laughs> Alright. We have one. Yeah, we're going to be able to get one on each side. Okay. So. Remember the method with the uh, quilt? We're going to do the same method with this one right here. We don't need it that big. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Go my way. There we go. I got it. Yep. Now we're going to go on down. I'm going to do it again. Alright, now we're going to do this side the same way. Need it that big. All right, let's sew them down. All right. Now then, let's cut our strings that we don't need no more. Now we want to turn these this around this way. And we want to iron it. Iron it down. Do this one the same identical way. Now then we want to turn this one in and sew it down and the same thing over here we'll sew it down. Alright, I think I am done with it. I don't think it needs any buttons or anything on it. I think it will work just fine. So, here we go to check it out. There's that one. And that one. <coughs> So, 
there she is. And I think it looks really good with this, uh, with this, uh, skirt. I like it. I like it. Alrighty. Now we're going to make a bag for Emmy to put her doll in and her doll clothes. So that way she'll have something to put it in. So I'll see you in the next one. Alright. I figured that I would put the doll, the stress on Emmy's doll. And I said, would it be nice to have a pair of boots to go with it? So I made her a pair of boots. And they fit pretty good on her. I mean, they look good to me, anyway. So, the way I did it, well, I took the doll, and I folded it like this. And I put it up as much as I wanted to, so and gave me seam allowance to sew. And then I drawed it out on the, like this right here, and then up like that. So I came out with this piece. Then I cut the piece out. And sewed it down. So that's all you got to do. Is. Do it like that. Where are my pins? Right. And then I'm going to cut it out. And don't forget the back stitch at the top. Because it won't, uh, it'll, it won't stay on its own. You got the back stitch. All right, so I'm just gonna go sew this all the way around, and I'm gonna back stitch right up here at the top. All righty. Now we're gonna turn it around. Come on, it doesn't want to come through. There we go. <coughs> now, I should have hemmed the top. I hemmed that one, but I forgot to hem that one. And there's no way to hem it now. I might have to make another one for, yeah, and make it a little bit tighter. Because this one here is just too loose. So I need to cut this one down a little bit. It's okay. I'm still learning. I'm getting it. I gotta have my coffee. Alright. So what I'm going to do is I got to go down a little bit on it. I am going to take this back stitch out. So I gotta go so it's gotta sew it a little bit tighter. Alright. I'm going to sew this down first, and then I'm going to sew it tighter. Alright, now it's a little bit tighter, so maybe, just maybe, let me get this off of here. Oh man, it looks crubby. It does. I'm going to have to start over, it looks like. Yeah, I don't like the way that looks. It didn't go the full tilt around. So, trash that and start over again. I'll get it. I'll get it. I'm telling you, I'll get it. It was the dog, the neighbor's dog barking. Alright. Here we got it again. 
that one turned out fine. Now, first thing we're going to do is we're going to sew a hem. I want to make sure I get it on the right side, the same side that one is. All right. Maybe this one will turn out. The other one didn't. That's okay. That one looks a whole lot better. I mean, they're not perfect, but that does look good on her. It's okay, bullet. All right. There they are. I think they look fine. I think she looks pretty. So now we got some boots. But yeah, I think they could go a little bit tighter. Yeah. I think what we ought to do is go in my pen. Go in this way. And then come up that way. But I will see that at another time. Other than that, I am done making Barbie doll clothes. I'm going to make her a thing. But it were. Well, we come in here to see what Mom is doing. What are you doing, Mom? Well, I've lost the shirt. You lost the shirt. What shirt? The shirt I was putting the little silver belt buttons on. You mean you stole my shirt? I stole it. You stole my shirt. Look I what asked she's you doing. I stole it and put silver buttons Look on. what she's doing. What are you doing, Grandma? I'm putting silver buttons on a red shirt. Look at that. Ain't that pretty? All right, I'll show you whenever she gets done. Well, here we have the Barbie doll clothes done. Uh-oh. I forgot to put that on. That. But look at the pretty the way Mom did this. It has a necklace around it, and it has beads going down. I think that looks real pretty. So, Mom had to have her hands in it. It's a good thing. It looks great. I like it. All right. I, as you can tell, I'm getting ready to make her bag. Thank you for watching. If you would like to donate to Poor Man Sewing, please go down here to Poor Man Sewing, mash it, go over to About, and right here is your Donate button, and mash on it. All donations will go to the sewing room uh, shed that we have, and they are very much appreciated. Thank you. I appreciate your, your donating.